most of the missed tackles were when you guys were trying to tackle high. Is that what you saw out there? Uh, yeah, uh, and probably not a, a good base when we made the tackle. Um, yeah, they do have elusive backs, and we didn't have a good base, and caused us to reach to make tackles, and we missed them. Guys, did they do anything substantially different offensively in the second half? I mean, the, the turn was remarkable. I mean, they came out and scored four straight possessions after not doing much in the first half. Were they doing anything differently, using the option game differently, blocking differently? Was anything done that changed what you were seeing? Well, um, I don't think they did too much differently. Um, I think their intensity in the second half was just a little more, like, it increased some. Um, and so it was, we had to just make up in our mind. We had to increase our intensity to get our job done. So. And also, can you guys talk about the turnover? Both of you take turns. Um, obviously, Jamal made a heck of a play to get a hand on that ball. Um, were you nervous during the replay portion of that? I mean, or what was your thought when the play actually happened? Did you know all along it was going to go your way? Well, uh, looking at the replay, I kind of seen that he had pitched it behind the line of scrimmage. And uh, I mean, I'm not going to lie, I was a little nervous, a little skeptical about it. But when the referee came out on the field and confirmed it, it was a great sigh of relief that we got the ball back. Yeah. Yeah, the same thing. I um, I was just like praying in my mind, like God just let the referee see like the same thing we saw, and I, it was just amazing. Once the referee confirmed that it went towards us, it it, it was great. Question: In terms of, I guess you know, played a lot of football here. Was that the worst half defensively you guys have had? I and mean, it just seemed like nothing. You couldn't get them off field. They caught every kind of break and got guys out of positions and all kind of stuff. Uh. I would say since I've been here, it, it probably has. Um, I mean, those guys came out the second half with the will to win. I mean, you know, normally we have a, a bad time of starting good, but we came out rocking from the jump, and we got complacent. And um, those guys, you know, they kept fighting. <coughs> and um, next thing you know, it was back in the ball game and on top. And, uh, you know, we picked it up and made a big stop. But at the end of the day, we got to get better. When you're complacent, what does that look like or feel like, you know, when you're on the field like that? I mean, being a veteran now on the field, I mean, it's guys, you know, hanging their heads low. I mean, when they make plays, you know, guys are up. But as soon as they, you know, do something bad, their heads, they, they hang, I mean, they hang, hang their heads low, I'm sorry. Um, and just seeing that on the field, we got to do better at that. I mean, stay focused and uh, play through all four quarters. Well, Sean, it seemed like uh, and you're almost kind of an example. Of this. The, the first game, the tackling wasn't great. The second game was a lot better against Tulane, and you had a really good game. Today, obviously, there were some missed tackles and so forth. I mean, is it playing an option team, or is it something else? Or how do you – what do you think happened in that regard? No, it just – we weren't focused second half. Um, just like I said, they came out ready to go. We came out slacking, and it showed. I mean, I mean, just like I said earlier, it came from, I mean, base probably. Uh, and uh, reaching when we tackle instead of uh, fitting the guy up. But at the same time, they got athletes that, um, on that side of the ball too as well to make us miss. So we just got to do better.